Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be a fragrance direct haul. I have done fragrance direct hauls in the past, so I will link some of my videos in the description box so you can check those out. My order came to around £100, but they had an offer on when I bought it that if you spend over £80, I think it was, you got 15% off. So my order cost £85, which is, you know, a little bit of discount, so I'm pleased with that. The thing that I don't really like about fragrance direct is that you can only use one offer per order like deals don't stack so for example you can either have free delivery or you can have a percentage off so I got 15% off on my order because it was about 15 pounds so it made sense for me because that was the higher discount so shipping did cost me two pounds which is not that bad but I wish that shipping was like automatically added to your cart so I've actually just realized that if you don't know what fragrance direct is like you'll be like what's this girl talking about so fragrance direct is just a website it's a legit website for people asking and they sell things that are maybe discontinued or overstocks those kind of thing so they can buy it in bulk and sell it cheaper so everything is legit on the websites they do a lot of perfume they do makeup they do skincare they do men's they do all sorts of stuff at really good prices i know this video is not sponsored about everything with my own money and fragrance direct don't know who i am or my channel or anything like that so I'm going to start with palettes first I've got the um the receipt up on my phone so I can tell you how much everything was so let's get started so what I have realized filming is that I need some kind of table in front of me because I put everything on my knees and then everything falls off while I'm talking so anyway let's get on to the haul the first thing I got was this aqua spray aqua spray by Revuel just looks like this so it's a hy hyaluronic acid moisturizer spray so it's for face and body I actually didn't realize it says body I thought it was just like for this the face and um, this was $1.99 obviously with my discount plus that so I thought this would be great in the mornings like because I'm really getting into things like spray on primers because it makes my morning you know a lot more manageable so I bought this in the hope that I could just spray it on and because I'm really getting into skincare at the moment I thought I could just spray it on and go so it'd be a great step so I will let you know how this one gets on because I've never heard of this brand before next item is I've never heard of this brand either just shake it up so it looks nicer this is the brand Psycholax. so some of the brands on this website I have never heard before it's just an aloe vera gel I really got into aloe vera while I was on holiday because it was great for my sunburn and I thought maybe I'll you know I'll do it on my skincare more often because it was really great on my like my body my suntan like um my burns <laughs> my minor burns I didn't get really burned um so yeah it was really good so this is it's a cute a calming so I say this again cooling calming cucumber and mint extract and this one was £2.75 so that's not too bad for how much product that you get next thing I got was by Max Factor so this is the Miracle Contouring Palette and it just has like all these cool things on the back so this was £4.99 and this is a cream, cream contour kit so when this was in boots I still think it's in boots it was 14.99 so it was really expensive and i really wanted to try it because i'm not really big into cream contouring but i wanted to give it a go anyway and i think these pans actually pop out as well which is pretty cool so if you wanted to well you could take one traveling but i don't know how you'd uh, cover it up so it didn't go it didn't go funky but i really like this kind of sculpt color here um, yeah so I thought I would give that one a go it was $4.99 I got two face masks and these are vitamin C sheet masks and these are $1.49 for two which is good because I normally pay about a pound each so I think it's like buy one get one half price and I found that vitamin C looks really good on my skin I've tried the Jess Wright ones from Poundland and my skin looks amazing after I've put those on so I thought I would give those a try for £1.49 I thought it was a little bargain now I have some palettes from the brand La Roche and I always get confused with La Roque and Lorac because it's like literally a one letter difference anyway La, La Roque usually do like cheap palettes like they look a little bit like Morphe palettes and they're very inexpensive but they've come out with these pro palettes and I thought they were really interesting so I wanted to give them a go they're not cheap 
but I kind of wanted to treat myself because it's my birthday mum and they look really nice so I can't even bust into this one oh and it's sealed as well so we'll have to break that one out okay so I've got this one out now this is the first one so this is the bakery box so it's like an eyeshadow palette and it's got two highlights in there as well so this one was the most expensive one this was actually 19.99 which is I think it's expensive for Lorac um, it's probably expensive for Fragrance Direct's website but it's cheaper than a Morphe palette so um, they did, I did actually have Morphe palettes actually on Fragrance Direct's website now they have the 35O and the 35V I think it is like the, the bluey one anyway I digress so this is the palette it is really pretty I just wanted to swatch oh that's a nice highlighter just wanted to swatch a few okay not too bad yeah okay okay so far yeah not the greatest but pretty nice but yeah I was really interested in trying like these is this video worthy let me know in the comments so from the Lorac Pro range I got two palettes now these were $14.99 each and they're actually a lot bigger than I was expecting so this is the intergalactic palette so it was just it was quite different so I thought you know I would pick this up wow these are actually like quite good quality that that green is lovely so look at that they swatch pretty good obviously you'd need to build up that matte green but the shimmer swatched really nice let's swatch another one so the shimmers seem quite powdery yeah definitely quite powdery but like good pigmentation to them the next palette is the pajama party so any kind of warm neutral lovers will really love this i kind of wish they had a mirror but you know at least it's something a little bit different so let's have a swatch of a few of these okay yeah so same kind of formula on the shimmers very powdery and that is what I'm terrible at finding places for swatches but they are what they have swatched like I did also buy a highlight palette from the same range now this did look a little bit lighter online than what it was but I think most of the shades are still going to be pretty wearable for me and um, the the formula is quite nice it's not as crumbly as the eyeshadows so let's have a swatch of these they're not blinding highlights, they're more like softer kind of metallics. But yeah, really pretty. So everything else was packed in like a little jiffy bag, which was pretty cool. I got two Kath Kidson hand creams. These are 50ml. So I got the Squiggle Cats one, which was really cute. And then I got a bird one. So I got the bird one for a friend's birthday. And then the cat one for me, just because I really love cats. And they're like $2.49 each. So Kath Kidson's quite expensive. So I thought that was a little bargain. I got a Rimmel Mascara. So this is what's it called the Wonderlash Volume Colorist Mascara so this is in black I also got this for another friend's birthday this was like $3.99 and I just love how this is the American packaging because the American ones they like hang on the shelf whereas ours in the UK will just have the mascara out and I think it's so much nicer to get it like this packaging so I thought it would be nice for a little gift I got one of these Carmex lip balms because I've had one of these in the past and it was really glossy. This was £2.45 so I know they're not that much um, like different in price in boots but I, I thought this was really cool and I was putting an order in anyway. So this is a peach and mango burst so yeah that's my new lip balm. So they used to sell these in boots. This is the brand Anatomicals. This was a sheet mask uh, or it's at least a hydrating face mask. Oh it's not a sheet mask it's just a you know a mask in a little packet so this was £1.25 and it says it's tropical hydrating mask and I just thought that was really cool and I know these were quite a good brand they used to sell them in boots so I thought I would give that one a go because I'm really into my sheet masks any kind of skincare 
Next thing I got is the Revlon Colour Stay. So I'm in the shade 150 Buff. This is the combination oily kind of finish because they have like a normal and dry one. And so it does say matte finish up at the top and it does have the pump. So this is the new packaging, like new, new, because this used to be like white and then they've just recently changed the packaging for this. So I think for this to be on the website with this packaging is like unbelievable because let me show you how it's advertised. You're not going to be able to see this but this is like the old original packaging so all the front of it was white and they still have ones on the website where they don't have the pump and the pump came in maybe about two years ago something like that so that is old stock but this is new stock so I'm really chuffed about that this is $4.99 I bought this for if you were to walk in boots or super drug this is $12.99 so this is an absolute bargain I really like this foundation it stays on my skin all day so yeah I'm chuffed that I've got that so next thing up is just a nail polish so this is the super gel K in boho alicious this was about £1.49 but um, they do have offers on the website like when you buy four or five of something you get one free so this was my free item so he's like quite chuffed with that because that's for my toes this is another thing that I bought for a friend's birthday because she really likes lip balms and things so this is the Technic Argan Oil Lip Conditioner with Vitamin E it was £1.99 so it's a really nice oil Technic have been doing some really good stuff lately so it's becoming a really good brand so I picked that one up I did get this Max Factor Lip Cushion and that's in the shade Starlight Coral but it is a bent so I have messaged Fragrance Direct about that because again that was meant to be a present but it's bent so we'll see what they come back and say um, but this was only £2.99 and these are quite expensive these they just give me a little sheet sample of a Retinol X anti-aging moisturiser so I never heard of that but they just chucked that in and the last thing that I've got is a sleek blush and again this is in the newer packaging I don't there we go you can see it on the light it just says sleek up here so I remember back in the day when sleek first came out sleek was written all over here in bigger writing so I know this is the newer packaging so this is the, the blush in the shade rose gold and it was 3 dollars oh just couldn't get it open so it just looks like this this is a dupe for NARS orgasm and I've had this blush in the past like years and years ago and I really Really wanted to get it and try it again um, because yeah I wanted to see if it was a dupe for orgasm because how pretty does that look and it was only 3 dollars so that was a little bargain so that was everything I got from Fragrance Direct it was a good size haul so thanks for watching today if you want to see a video on them palettes let me know because I'm not sure if they're video worthy but thanks for watching today I will link some more Fragrance Direct videos in the description box and I will see you again shortly bye